generally a forgiving person. But when I've been through, what I've been through with Verizon, and I'm recording on the Verizon phone, guess what? I've had shoddy internet all day. Or most of the day, anyhow. Not to mention, I went a couple months ago to get my SIM card replaced on my uh, old phone. And when they say, well, we can't do that, you're going to need a new phone. I told them straight up, I said, I cannot afford a new phone. I'm on the, uh, I'm on this ah, I'm on fixed income. I cannot afford a new phone. Oh, that's okay. We can provide one for you at no charge. Well, guess what? They went and took out most of my livelihood. Let me tell you something. I want to warn anybody out there that is willing to listen. Do not, please do not, please do not switch to Verizon. Because you're going to get ripped off. People are telling you, oh, it's, it's the best cell phone carrier. Yeah, when I switched in January of 2020, it was the best cell phone carrier. But guess what? Around this time last year, service got rotten. Extremely rotten. Nobody wants to deal with a company. Especially where they rip off somebody that's got a disability. Let me tell you something. I'm generally a peaceful, gentle, forgiving man. But if you run over me because of my disability, guess what? You're going you're gonna to make me mad. Okay? It's like I said, I'm generally a, a peaceful, forgiving person. But don't piss me off by using my disability to make me an easy mark. Because I'm not going to take this lying down. Not by a long shot. Uh-uh. Verizon rips off customers really bad.